Hey everyone, this is Gabriel B. 1231. Um, I promised you guys all um, that uh, I was going to do an unboxing video of the uh, T-Rex 600 Nitro Pro Limited Edition. Um, um, I got the standard kit with no blades and no electronics. Um, I I couldn't afford it right now, but I did. I do have um, on the side that shows all the electronics. I did buy some Edge. 603 millimeter fly bar um, blades. Um, I bought a OS 55 HZ, um, uh, the standard aligned pipe, and I do have one of these, um, the engine starter, the line super starter. Uh, but I'm probably going to go with the three DS 610s for my cycling and a DS 6 uh, DS 650 for uh, the tail, and not, I'm not going to use. The GP 780. I'm probably going to get a Futaba 520 gyro. Um, I do not have a regulator or a governor, but I do. I will be getting that, and it's going on my uh, DX8. Um, I went ahead and opened the box, and I got the canopy out. It came in this styrofoam, and there's my manual. I got this. I took it out. It's really nice. If you get yours and you see this indentation right here, don't worry, it's n that's how it's supposed to be. But okay, so we're gonna open up the box. We open the box. This is what ha this is what how it comes packaged. You've got your main blades, frame set, main rotor head set, and electrical devices. I suppose that electrical devices don't have anything. Which indeed they don't. Um, we'll open and take out the main rotor headset. And in this box we have hold on, we have uh, the swash, the main button. Uh, we have the paddles, uh, fly bar cage. Um, also have the spindle. Uh, and anti-rotation pin, I think, is in here. I'm not really sure, but we'll take that out. Next in the box is my bearing, and here's the anti-rotation pin right here. Um, and I got my receiver and all of that, so that's good. We'll put that to the side. Next. Next we have the fan unit and clutch right here. Um, I think that this is going to be a really simple build for me because um, I'm pretty good at building TXs. Um, I also have a 450 Pro. Um, I also have the TX500 Electric Super Pro. I have the 250, which I'm not really good flying at that because I'm not that good with a smaller size helicopter. Um, but I am progressing with that, and I have a, I just ordered another helicopter, the 700 limited edition, it's got the same color scheme as that canopy, but a bigger size, so, can't wait for that, but, and you got your main drive system, main gear, now, we'll, we'll that up, now we'll go into the main blades, the main blades, I purchased the kit only, so, I don't expect to be any blades, in which indeed there is none. You got a nice boom, carbon fiber boom. Um, a line's coming out with um, all their tail booms are going to be carbon fiber. Um, I can see I got the push rods, uh, linkages and stuff, and torque tube. So it's going to be a really bu fun build. I might post, I'm probably end up going to end up posting a um, build videos. Uh, Exception on my channel, and uh, any of you guys that are having trouble building yours, I'll be showing you how to build it. And then next we have, last but not least, the frame set. I personally, I just took out the canopy, so everything comes in the canopy with that foam wrap. Um, you've got your grease, your Loctite, you got zip ties, you got all your screw sets. Uh, you got your blade holders, you got your gyro tape, and <clears throat> that's it. 
I'll probably just use their grease. I don't have any on me. I didn't really pick up any in my local hobby shop at Jake's Performance in Santa Rosa, California. But we got that. We'll put that to the side over here. You got your main frame. And when when you assemble this, you want to make sure that you sand use sandpaper and sand all these edges because you don't want anything cutting. Um, so that's that. Uh, got your fuel tank, some cheap aftermarket ta uh, tubing. I suggest going and buying some good, better fuel tubing. But it is provided, so good job line. Um, this is just your fuel tank and your clunk. So it's not assembled in it. In this bag, you have your tail rotor blades. Uh, you have your tail uh, system. Uh, you have your stabilization. You got uh, oh, that's interesting. I didn't. Uh, and it said um, um, I bought it on a main hobbies. They said they weren't going to include any uh, tail blades or um, main blades. So that's pretty weird because they're right here. So good for me. But I'll probably buy some edge ones. So there's that. And then here's the torque tube drive system. It's really nice, uh, so I'll probably be building that soon. I'm probably going to start today. And you got your skids and your, map, your landing skids and your landing gear. That seems a little bit easy. So, Well, I'm going to start building, so I will start a build video. So catch with you later. Thanks, and subscribe. Have a good day. Bye.